Hi guys, welcome back and Happy New Year! I hope you guys enjoyed your Christmas, your New Year holidays. I had so much fun like just resting and spending time with my family and now I'm ready, not quite ready, <laughs> but I'm ready to film this video for you guys. I hope you guys are excited. I took a lot of time to curate my favorite skincare products of 2018 from cleansers all the way to moisturizers, wash off masks, everything. For each category, there'll be like three or four different skincare products. I really hope that I could give you guys more options in terms of you know, different textures, different ingredients and also for different skin types because everyone takes in the skincare differently. Makes sense, right? Okay, so without further ado, let's get started! Alright, holy smokes, let's start with cleanser. My favorite all day cleanser I use in the morning and at night is the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. I never felt that I would love a cleanser so much until I found this. So gentle, it smells like cucumbers. It's a gel cleanser, so it doesn't foam up, it wouldn't dry out your skin. It feels so light, it feels so fresh. Don't be deceived by how gentle it feels on the skin. It actually could remove makeup as well. Although you guys know that I am a believer in double cleansing, but especially if you guys who don't wear a lot of makeup or some days you're just so lazy to double cleanse this actually does the job after cleansing the skin will feel super soft you just feel mm. now my second favorite this year this might surprise you guys because I've never mentioned this brand to you guys philosophy purity made simple I just started trying out their products last year and I'm amazed by how much I enjoy their products and also it's much more affordable than fresh I understand that a lot of you guys might not have the budget for the fresh cleanser do check this out texture wise it's different from fresh it's actually more like a cream cleanser very creamy and nice and nourishing on the skin it claims to be a three-in-one cleanser for face eyes so yeah both of these you can use as your all-in-one cleanser and uh, it wouldn't sting your eyes it's very gentle it's also very hydrating I would highly recommend you guys to give this a try as well now on to first step of cleansing only at night the double cleansing method which I've talked a lot of times I personally love to use cleansing oils just melts down all the makeup so beautifully so last year I did mention that I love the Shu Mura one it's still one of my favorites also the Claire's cleansing oil which I'm gonna show you guys right here there's another cleansing oil that I've been using last year which is the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Botanical Cleansing Oil it removes your makeup and melts everything away beautifully it smells so therapeutic it smells like lavender so if you guys love lavender you could try this out yeah it doesn't feel too oily but of course you see a cleansing oil it feels very gentle very light another of my favorite I think this is my favorite first step cleansing of 2018 is this one the origin cleansing makeup removing jelly with willow herb and I think it's so innovative I haven't seen any makeup remover that looks like this it comes out in this jelly form it kind of works like you know those cleansing balms you just work it on the skin melt into this milk and it removes everything beautifully fully comes in a tube so convenient so easy to travel around compared to the cleansing oils it doesn't sting my eyes very gentle somehow reminds me of you know those cleansing balms but a lot of cleansing balms that I use they actually makes my eyes blurry as I try to remove my makeup from my eyes and second of all very troublesome you know you have to open it you have to scoop it out and then sometimes your hands are dirty and then you have to close it back it's like a lot of steps you know <laughs> compared to a cleansing oil where you just so I found a perfect one that sort of like replaced a cleansing balm and it doesn't sting my eyes and all the cleansing oils that I had recommended to you guys it doesn't sting my eyes which is so important for me next category are toners my top pick I mean <laughs> what else could it be? <laughs> you guys already know that my favorite is this Origins Mega Mushroom Treatment Lotion it's just like a magic in a bottle it's very hydrating it's so so soothing sensitive skin and you guys who have redness in the skin this little baby right here actually helps to restore resilience it helps to strengthen the skin and all the environmental pollution second favorite toner is this one by Fresh beautiful bottle infused with rose petals it's just so aesthetically pleasing rose lovers dream come true super hydrating I think it's especially great for you guys who have dehydrated or dry flaky skin of course roses they have soothing properties as well definitely softens the skin and helps to kind of like improve the appearance of your pores as well the other toner that I like is actually a mist by Caudalie and this is their grape water I love how minimal the ingredients 
this as well 100% grape water super refreshing and it gives you that surge of hydration oh, look at that Mm, so refreshing it also soothes hydrates and moisturizes the skin when i do an exfoliating mask or wash off mask after i remove the mask i love to use this to balance my skin refresh the skin and rehydrate the skin best part is it's really affordable it's only 75 ringgit 200 ml half the price of the origins one or the fresh one now we're going into essences and serum firstly the lightweight fermented essences the sk2 treatment essence i'm still using it i still love it i love how it absorbs into the skin how it actually helps to keep my skin healthy another one that you guys know i've been using this on my previous videos as well and it's the fresh black tea kombucha facial essence this is actually my second bottle sk2 one is more watery but this one has some silk texture to it, it smells better than sk2's the fresh uses fermented black tea kombucha which helps in anti-aging it helps in anti-pollution it gives extra plumpness and glow to the skin as well now on to serums unlike essence serums are more targeted so depends on what kind of serums you buy like anti-aging serum hydrating serum or brightening serum me personally i look for something that helps in anti-aging at the same time that gives me plumpness to the skin help to revive the dull skin my first favorite Estee Lauder ANR i actually only just started using this last year packed with hyaluronic acid as well as their special technology i love how it actually adds radiance and plumpness to the skin this product has been around for years with improved formula each time it's great for all skin types definitely for you guys who want extra radiance plumpness prevent the process of aging definitely check this out the other one that i love so much L'Occitane's Immortel Reset Serum it's mainly targeted for people who are stressed who have dull skin and i really like the texture of the serum it has these little yellow dots it's actually oil inside but surprisingly it doesn't feel oily as you apply it it will melt it absorbs so quickly especially great for you guys even with oily or combo skin it wouldn't leave like greasiness or oiliness i feel that it really does help to keep the skin healthy and more radiant final serum is this one by thank you farmer the true water deep serum it really leaves the skin glowing and it's very very hydrating it even has anti-aging ingredients like adenosine prevent fine lines and wrinkles it's just a beautiful serum in a beautiful slippery texture now on to moisturizers beginning of last year i was using the sk2 rna airy milky lotion it's definitely a high-end moisturizer great for anti-aging it really leaves my skin plump healthy and nice i've emptied that already after that i started to try more moisturizers my favorite one that is less expensive mid and range from fresh lotus face cream and i think it's great for all skin types and it smells amazing it absorbs so quickly it's not heavy at all it has anti-aging ingredients yeah super seven complex it's just very hydrating it's definitely one of my top picks i'm looking for something more lightweight especially if you guys have oily skin origins ginseng energy boosting gel moisturizer a great lightweight texture and the smell is also very refreshing super hydrating as well it has coffee inside caffeine it helps to wake up the skin amazing affordable moisturizer in my opinion Another one that is even more lightweight but it's actually super hydrating The Clinique Moisture Search This one is the kind of moisturizer that I can even use it throughout the day Because it's super lightweight and it just refreshes the skin It's also very soothing, it's made of aloe vera other than a hyaluronic acid But if you're someone who has dry flaky skin I think you need something that is heavier than this And the final one that I've been enjoying a lot as well Is this Philosophy Take a Deep Breath Oil-Free Oxygenate gel cream something about this moisturizer keeps making me going back to use it it's also very lightweight somehow it feels very moisturizing on the skin every time i use this moisturizer it just gives me this baby soft smooth skin now on to face mask my personal favorite part of skincare it actually helps a lot in improving my skin and giving me the glow firstly fresh really won my heart it's so hard to choose a favorite something about fresh mask that just gives you this sensorial 
real experience of masking the ingredients that they have how they feel on the skin and how they look I love this lotus mask it's also an exfoliating mask that helps to buff the skin it helps to make the skin really smooth after you use it and just very refresh skin is smoother and softer and more radiant the other one that I really love is the black tea instant perfecting mask look at that guys it actually looks like mashed potato it's made of black tea so you know black tea has a lot of great antioxidants that help to protect the skin and helps in anti-aging it's super super cooling as you apply on the skin it almost has this minty sensation as soon as you wash it off it really helps smoothen out the pores and makes it feel very refreshed and hydrated and plump I know fresh products are pretty expensive but the great thing about their mask is they came out with the smaller size ones I will highly recommend you guys to first try their mini mask it's quite affordable and you can use it for a pretty long time especially if you guys want to multi mask or try a lot of their different masks other masks that I love firstly this one is an oldie but goodie Origins Original Skin Retexturizing Mask with Rose Clay Boy, I love this for probably 2 years So much function in one mask Rose Clay extract all the dirt and impurities and unclog the pores They are signature Canadian willow herb to give you a healthier glowing skin Jojoba beads helps to exfoliate the skin as well An amazing mask that helps to retexturize your skin, deep cleanse the skin It does soften the skin and smoothen the skin so definitely still in my favorites Organics turmeric brightening and exfoliating mask it uses turmeric which is a great ingredient that helps to brighten the skin even in breakouts as well it helps to clear the skin so this mask actually has tiny little granules as you massage it you can feel the beads that helps to exfoliate the skin every time I use this mask it's very invigorating and it leaves my skin baby soft as well and because it's an organic product it tries to use as much natural organic ingredients it doesn't use any A shea B shea acids like glycolic acid they use a safer alternative to those and they use natural ingredients like aspen bark papaya enzyme to replace the acids that helps to exfoliate the skin if you want to try core organics products i would highly recommend you guys to try this finally i have a last mask to recommend to you guys this is so life-changing probably the most surprising thing that i've tried the results were just so transformative philosophy micro delivery resurfing peel it has two different products to use at once. Firstly, this is vitamin C peptide resurfacing crystals. It really smells like oranges like vitamin C. Firstly, damp your skin because it's quite harsh and abrasive actually. You damp your skin and then you massage it all over the skin with this. Secondly, add this product. It's an AHA and BHA lactic acid and salicylic acid activating gel. So you mix these two products together and boy, I've never had a product that made my skin feel so smooth there are so many masks that I've recommended this one gave me the most transformative baby soft smooth skin I've ever experienced so I actually tried it on Joseph my boyfriend as well and he felt the same if you guys are beginners in exfoliating I wouldn't recommend you guys because maybe it's too intense I'm not sure for you guys who want something that is more transformative if you guys are not sensitive to potent acids like salicylic lactic acid this is mind-blowing guys for sleeping mask my favorite is definitely the Suazu's overnight vitalizing mask in a creamier side but it's actually pretty lightweight and a little goes a long way and it just leaves the skin super moisturized hydrated and plump every time I use this the next day my skin really feels plump radiant and glowy it may be in the pricier side but believe me it really takes a while to finish it up I have this for a long long time it has ginseng anti-aging ingredients hyaluronic acid honey definitely still my favorite one of course there's the ever so popular Laneige water sleeping mask is in this super lightweight texture I think it's especially great for you guys who really want something super lightweight someone with oily combination skin as you apply it it's very cooling very soothing quickly like maybe just in a few minutes it absorbs completely into the skin with a special moisture wrap technology it still moisturizes the skin it still hydrates the skin oh my gosh all right guys i think i did it i hope so i didn't miss anything thank you guys so much for watching i really really hope you guys enjoyed this video although i think it's a tad bit long but i really wanted to 
to share as many good products as I can. I really can't wait to try more products this year and you see more skincare videos from me for sure. If you like this video, please please give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. I'll try to reply to all of you as always. I'll see you guys in my next one. Mwah.